some cases you may want to edit a schedule so that you can have multiple values edited at once. One of the simplest ways to do this is to turn off itemize every instance and to also use a sorting tool so that you can group items together. This example is for Revit 2024. If you have an earlier version, you may not see the various option that will appear. So in this case, I have a schedule where I want to have files that have the same date here to all have a similar date of the same thing. But notice that the dates are different here. So the way I'm going to fix this is I'm going to come in and I'm going to start by filtering the view to say we're going to sort by the sheet issue date. Now when we do this, notice that the sorting will actually change and it'll put them in sequence. So the next thing to do is to come back and change sorting and grouping to undo itemize every instance. This creates a group. So all the items that have the same date are grouped together. Now in Revit 2023 and newer releases, you have an option that says varies. In older releases, this would be a blank field if the values had the same date, but everything was different. So they made that change to make this a little simpler. So on the 2-12-13 date, now what I want to do is I want to say I want all of these dates to either use a pre-existing date, like 2 23 and that becomes the new internal review date for all of those sheets. If I go down the list now and I also want to change the second one here, I can type in a field and say 04-01-23 and have those dates be the same. Now, what will happen is when you come back to filters and sorting and grouping or however you're doing this and you itemize every instance, notice that now all of these fields that had the same date or any other tool that can be used to filter this now have the same value. So that's how you can edit multiple values for the same for different files at the same time.